Hey, look! I doubt if that fire's been burning a thousand years. Freddy, this place gives me goosebumps. You have violated the sacred temple. If you do not leave this village now, you will remain here forever. Okay, we found him. Now let's go. Not yet. I want to check that altar. You check it. I'll wait right here. Okay, I'll just be a moment. Daphne? She's gone! Daphne! Daphne! Lead me to it. Uh, what's it smell like? Indian corn? Beef jerky? I'll try anything. <laughs> Man, those Pueblo Indians sure knew how to live. We have salami, ham, canned sardines, pudding, not the... Hey, wait a minute. This isn't Indian food. Rog Roo. Ruby Roo. Scooby food? Yeah, 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 yeah. It is dog food. Scooby, we found the dog napper's hideout. But uh, I don't see any dog nappers around, so why not fortify ourselves with a groovy little snack? <laughs> and the ham slice connected to the rye bread. Lettuce connected to the boiled egg. Mustard slapped on a salami slice. And the cheese are connected to the devil ham. Hey, what's up? <laughs> Scooby-Doo, where are you? <laughs> Untie me, quick. That witch doctor may come back at any time. And a rogue? The dogs? Oh, sure, we'll free the dogs. Now hurry. I got a hunch there's a secret passage around here someplace. There it is. Velma, what are you doing there? I don't know. I sat down to rest. The next minute I'm here. Freddy, Velma, quick, this way. Good boy, Scooby. You found them and freed them all. Does this mean we've solved the dog napping mystery? Not yet. Hey, Scooby, see if any of your pals know anything about that witch doctor or the dog napper. You know where he is, Scooby? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let's go. We're right behind you. While I'm searching for Scooby, I'll just finish this little morsel. What a close shave! That was almost a catastrophe. Hey, Shaggy, come on, follow the dogs. <laughs> come on, Shaggy. <laughs> They spotted it! The dog happened! Why, it's Buck Masters, the owner of Big Red! He's the dog napper! You blasted kids! Why didn't you mind your own business? Catching dog nappers is our business, Mr. Masters. After all, Scooby-Doo is a dog, and we love him very much. Oh! <laughs> that was quite a plot you kids uncovered. Who would have suspected Masters of dog-napping his own pet? He decided to win the dog show by dog-napping the only three dogs who could beat Big Red. Then Big Red was to turn up just before the show and win first prize. You said something about a phantom Indian on horseback. What about that? Simple. He used a movie projector from the back of his truck. Look, Geronimo! He's back again! Whoopie-woo! <laughs> <laughs>